Supernatural occurrences around Tina. A poltergeist spirit. They're classified as demons. Things that are unbelievable. She was possessed by a spirit. It boggles the imagination. What drives a woman to kill her three-year-old daughter? We are near the home of the Russians. Christina Resch was known as Poltergeist Girl. There were so many negative experiences in her life. When I was a 14-year-old kid, things started happening in my home. They began to believe that this is demonic. People believe she had these telekinetic powers that when Christina loses control, could be explosive. She was emitting electromagnetism. You have to see it to believe it. Look at that. Tina did this. You could see the fear. Something changed. The house felt absent of all joy. She just ran away. I ended up marrying a man. Having Amber literally saved my life. She loved Amber dearly. Some psychokinetic things that started happening that were more destructive. They tell me that he was dead. This child's been severely physically abused. She had been arrested. It became a circus. Something changed. We had all this evidence. It was overwhelming. Christine's been in prison for over 30 years for a murder that took place when she was somewhere else. It's ludicrous. I knew I wanted Christina's case, someone we wanted to fight for. I want Christina to have her day in court. I mean, murder my The fact that I was a single mother and had supernatural issues, none of that helped me. Demons and Saviors. Only on Hulu.